Hey everyone, so here I'm doing exercise 7.1. This is from a fraction chapter of a class 6. So this is the second question and the question here is color the parts according to the given fraction. So we have given fraction, we have to color according to that. So let's start with the first one. In the first one they have given 1 upon 6. Remember the denom denominator represent how many total parts are there in a whole figure. So here 6 means 6 parts are there. You can count here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So out of 6, they are asking us to color how many parts? 1. We have to check the numerator and see how many number are given. That many parts we have to color. Here only 1 is given. It means we have to color only one part here. So let's start coloring it. So you can color any parts. So let me take this one. So this will be um, one part. So this is the figure. First answer. First one. Now second one. In the second one you can see we have 1 upon 4. So 1 upon 4 means 4 parts are given. Out of that only one part we have to color. So let us color a red color. You can color anywhere in any one part. So here I am coloring with a green color. Okay. The next one uh, we have 1 upon 3. So three parts are given. Again only one part. One is there in the numerator. Only one part we have to color here. So you can choose any one part and you can start coloring. So this is the part. Then next one we have a 3 upon 4. So out of 4 they are asking us to color 3 parts. So 4 parts are given. You can just color any 3 out of it. So here we have this is a one part we have covered and this is one more part and this is third one. That's it. You can just color any three parts. Okay. The next one, last one, 4 upon 9. So 9 parts, are we can, you can just count how many parts are given. For all out of this 9 parts, you have to color only 4. So you can just randomly color anywhere. So here I'm going to color this rectangle. This is 1. I'm going to color this again. And this is a third one. And then this is a fourth one. That's it. It is quite simple question. Only check the numerators. Denominator all represent number of parts. You have to just check the numerator and color that many parts. So I hope it's clear. In case you have any question or doubt, you can drop a comment below. Thank you so much for watching.